thought I'd drop in and show you another little DIY from Recycled Free Sources. I remember when I got all those pallets last year. Well, I'm going to show you what I do with some of these other ones. Remember me getting these. These little frames that I got scattered all over. They uh, were used to hold pipes, like PVC pipes and conduit pipes when they're shipping them in so they don't roll out all over on the truck. Well, I don't know if you can see down here, but we made a long bed, long little mini raised bed to plant some little spring flowers. The bulbs that I had that I got real cheap. That's what we did with some of them. Now I'm going to show you what I'm doing with some other ones. We have gone and put four of these together with boards on each of the four corners to hold them in place. Now we're putting a little bit of wasted hay that Miss Laverne here has contributed with some of her droppings and her urine and putting that in the bottom. And then I have a bunch of composted sawdust that we put in for the first to try to fill up the first half. And then the top half I've got with nice yummy compost. And then I have a little bit of mulch to put on top. And this is what I'm going to do to try to put down the fence because this is going to be our new garden area. It's 130 feet by 80 feet or 100 feet. So we're going to have a nice big garden. But we're going to dig out a duck pond over in that corner over there and put a duck house over there because we're going to have our ducks in here for our garden posse. But we're going to try to get these beds to go all the way down the fence line so the ducks can't go out to go into the road. So the goal is to try to put raised beds all the way around the perimeter of the fence to keep the ducks in. So that way we don't have to put fence on top of fence. All right. Never be afraid to live your dream because it can happen. Avern, what are you doing? Oh, she's being a goat. Blessings to you and yours. Have an amazing day. Mm -hmm.